Now that we have our first chat blaster built, we're gonna go inside to Mobile Monkey, create our first chat blast and actually launch it live. So let's go into Mobile Monkey and see how to do this. So remember that the bot builder is where all your pages live, but it's not where other things live. Um, this left hand menu is where you'll find all the different features and functions of getting leads and blasting your chat blasts and, and drip campaigns out to the leads and out to your contacts. So this is gonna live under mar marketing automation. It's the first option under marketing automation. You click chat blaster, okay? Now we have a couple of previous chat blasters that have gone out in this Mobile Monkey chatbot account. And I'm gonna go here and create a new chat blast. So if you guys, for the first time, if you're following along with me for, for the first time, this is what you're gonna do, new chat blast. And we have a couple different options here that we need to configure. So the name is important because you wanna be able to reference this later on. So I'm gonna type in um, SM special coupon. Um, I usually use QQ to indicate that I started off with a quick question as opposed to starting off with um, just a, a, in, in a marketing text widget giving the information up front because that different, then I like to see how those different types of chat blasts actually perform. It gives you really good data moving forward. Um, and you could put a date if you want to. Um, I'm gonna leave that out for now because I recognize what this is. And maybe I'm gonna put dog GIF or something like that because that helps me really remember what this chat blast was real quick. So I'm gonna do all contacts, right? I'm gonna send this one out to everybody. And what's very important is you have to choose the page that the blast that, that you're blasting. So the welcome page is that default page we're not blasting. If you click the drop down, you have a you'll see a list of all the pages. And this could be a few, and this could be hundreds of pages that are in your um, Mobile Monkey account. You could search for the page that you've labeled, or you could just scroll down um, to where it is in this list. And that's what also makes groups so helpful because these drop downs and these drop downs appear in a number of different places inside Mobile Monkey. These drop downs are all, are all organized by group. So that hierarchy and that structure makes it really easy to find things. So I'm gonna go down to my Chat Blast Facebook course, right? And I have that one page, Sofa Mania coupon, SM Special 20%. And I'm gonna not test this blast because I've tested the blast already. And I'm gonna to need to mark, mark a purpose. Um, we're gonna talk about purposes a little bit later in more detail. For now, and in most cases, just select non-promotional subscription. Okay, that's the, that's the option you wanna choose nine out of 10 times. I'm gonna to choose to send this immediately. If you're busy or you're on the road, you, or you're just doing a lot of work at once, you could send these blasts later. So it's sort of like a hybrid between a blast and a drip. It's like the same way in MailChimp, you could send a blast later. So I could schedule this for later today or tomorrow or whatever it is in a few days. Um, if I know that there's an important event that's coming up that's related to my company's industry, um, or just internally at my company, or there's other promotions that are being run, or for whatever reason we wanna make this, let's say, um, have this done in conjunction with a different type of ad campaign that's running on Google or is running on, on radio or whatever it may be, I might wanna schedule this, um, these blasts to go out at different times, but for our cases, and in most cases when you're doing a chat blast, you're gonna send it out immediately. And once we click this button, there's no turning back, right? This is going to, this blast is being sent now to 1,300 real contacts of our company's Facebook page. And I'm gonna teach you how to monitor that um, as it happens. So we're gonna click send and we're gonna confirm and there's no going back. Now before sending out this blast, we're seeing a warning sign here up by the chat, spl the chat blast detail. And I think I know why that is. It's because I'm currently using this all contacts audience inside a different group campaign or inside a different chat blast campaign that's currently running, that currently has these contacts in the queue. Um, if I hover over, we'll see what the issue is. And yes, audience is in use for another active campaign. So I could create a new audience that's the same contacts. I could also create, um, use, let's say, this audience, which is untitled, which is the same 13, 18 contacts. This, this might also be in use for another campaign. Let's try to use all contacts July 17th. Okay, we're gonna try to use this audience and we're gonna click send, double check all my settings. And I'm gonna show you how to create these audiences once we get to the audience section of the lecture. And there it is, it's going out. Okay, now I'm gonna go into Facebook Manager and we're gonna be able to see these chat blasts coming to our customers if we monitor the inbox. And we're gonna take a quick peek because it's exciting. I wanna see you to make sure it's, it's working. So I go into the Facebook Manager and I can see all these messages going out now, right? So, so I go into Facebook Messenger and I see all these messages going out. We're gonna see some people unsubscribe, some people interact, um, and we just get a sense of, of what's happening here. So 
I'm just gonna pick, look, look, they're all popping in. There's tons of them going out. But see how exciting this is? Like, we literally sent out, okay, here, so we sent a GIF. Let's grab this one. We sent a GIF. Unsubscribe. Here, sent a GIF. So, two to three. We, got, we have people responding, right? People are actually, like, engaging with this chatbot immediately. Like, this is real time. I'm recording this course in real time. This happened nine seconds, 15 seconds after we sent it out. People are, are like getting marketing materials. They're engaging, they're answering our questions. Um, 600 people just got this message and it's gonna be personalized with name. And now we're getting information about um, what products they're gonna click on. We're gonna see where the traffic comes through Google Analytics. Like, this is wild stuff, right? Um, here, we sent another GIF. This person unsubscribed. Okay, that's okay. We're going to get some uns uns unsubscribes. I told you before that when we, well, the previous uh, whiteboard, drip campaigns are going to be much more subtle, less unsubscribers. Chat blasts are aggressive, right? Like we're like really getting in there. We're trying to sell. Um, we're trying to do the dirty work and we're going to turn some people off, but we're going to attract more people. That's sort of the game of chat blasts, um, but really exciting. So here, uh, no idea, a few, LOL, but I moved and I knew, but I moved and I knew living area. Old furniture is in basement. So people like people are actually talking to us. Like, how crazy is this? Um, how, many how many hours a day do you think you spend on your couch? I'm trying to decide which one I want, LOL. Um, so a real person can now, a real chat person on Sofamania's team is gonna take over this chat and respond because like she's actually sending like um, a real message. Let's see anything else interesting here. So obviously not, not everyone's gonna respond within the first few minutes, but as you're seeing, um, quite, quite, a bit of, uh, quite a number of people um, are responding right away. And unlike email that has all these aggressive filters, like this stuff is getting to everybody. Like when I send a chat blast to my contact list, it's everyone in Messenger, unless they've recently unsubscribed, is receiving these messages, right? It's, it's powerful, it's powerful. You're getting your brand in front of people where they are on their mobile phones in the most popular messaging app in the world right now by a long, 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 long shot. Um, so very cool stuff. Um, let's see here. Four hours, okay, we sent him the information. And <laughs> writes, unsubscribe, you're annoying, okay. like. Exactly, like that's gonna happen with chat blasts and that doesn't mean you did anything wrong. Some people are gonna be annoyed, which is why they have the option to unsubscribe and it worked. They clicked stop, they, they, click, they, they typed stop, they clicked unsubscribe and she told us you're annoying so it's okay. Like, you know, we could, we could write back now and say like, um, we apologize, didn't mean to annoy you. And obviously like I'm not, I'm, I'm not a Facebook community manager but hey, I'm here, why not? So like, um, you know, it's really cool stuff. So this person, right, I don't know why, why do you wanna know? I'll tell you why, because we wanna keep you now on our audience list for longer because you've engaged with our bot, right? So that's really cool marketing at play right here.